Reminds me of the day. Actually, now that I think about it, I don't think we've ever trained together, Yamcha. So hey, why don't we go a few rounds? Well, you, you're kidding, right? I wouldn't even come close to being a match for you. Not to mention I've been giving up fighting. Hey now, I've retired from fighting too. I got a family to think about now. Well, I guess there's nothing I can do about Krillin having a family. Guess robot wives have needs too. But you know, Yamcha, you're not married. And you don't have a family or anything, right? <laughs> You see, about that, I, uh, it's, it's complicated. I have no idea what you're talking about. But, if you don't have a real reason- Goku. Uh, uh, Enough about me already. Let's just focus on the upcoming battle. Let's just, let's think of this fight as us training together, okay? Oh, and please try not to kill me. <laughs> nice! I think you're getting the hang of it. Hey! You there, my body! You're a pretty darn good fighter, you know that? Hope 18 and Marin are okay. They're back at Master Roshi's place. With this many baddies around, I could spell trouble. I wouldn't worry. I mean, 18's stronger than you, right? <laughs> yeah. That may be true, but you don't have to put it so bluntly. <laughs> oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> hey, Krillin. There's some kind of huge power out there. Feel it? Yeah, I did. It's different. It's not like the clones we've been fighting. I wonder, is it Cell? Could be. The energy is similar to Cell's, yes. But it feels a bit smaller, doesn't it? That's odd. We can sense Cell's energy but not the person he's fighting with. An opponent with no energy? Hey, do you think maybe Cell's fighting 16? Wait, I've got it. He's an android. You can't sense the energy of an android. We might be able to find a clue or two. I say we check it out. My 
knew it! Cell! And his opponent is down! Eighteen! Oh no, please! Spare her! I'll do anything that you say! Um, excuse me, what's going on here? What have you done to my wife? Well, if it isn't Goku and his annoying noseless sidekick. Cell. Holy crap! You are back! That's awesome! To tell the truth, I always did want another go at you. <laughs> Glad to hear it, because I'm back from the dead and ready to bury you in your wretched offspring. Krillin! Let me take care of Cell right now. You need to make sure 18's okay. Thanks, Goku. 18! Good. She's out cold. Oh my, do you know her? Is she okay? I'm so sorry. She sacrificed herself to save me. <laughs> you monster! Cell! You'll pay for this! <laughs> Look at this spectacle she's putting on. So be it. We'll just have to defeat them all right here, right now. Well, I gotta say, I am happy that I'm getting a chance to fight Goku. <laughs> Sorry, stranger, but I'm gonna need you to look after 18 for me. Cause I'm gonna kick Cell's butt! Don't make me laugh. Defeat me. As I recall, your power doesn't even compare to that of your better half, 18. Back down, Krillin! This isn't the kind of guy you want to tangle with! What is a husband if he can't protect his wife? Ooh! <laughs> Someone's coming. Damn right! I don't care how strong you are! Touch my wife, you're going down! Time to begin the match! Get ready! Go! Give it your best <laughs> shot! Soon, you idiots will learn the error of your ways. All oh, you 
will burn. Then, no amount of regret will save you. What is he babbling about? Oh, ah! no, no crap! Damn it! The bug ran off! Can't feel his power either. He's gone. He got away. Eighteen! Are you okay? It's okay. Don't worry. She's just unconscious. But we'd better get her looked at just to be on the safe side. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, thanks so much for standing up for Eighteen. No, it's me who should be thanking you. You're quite strong, the both of you, really. Especially considering you managed to withstand the effects of the waves. Waves? Do you know what's going on? Oh, uh... What happened to Eighteen? Please, I need to know what happened! Clearly instructed her to stay indoors, if she'd only listened! Very well. I was a researcher, a once proud employee of the Red Ribbon Army. Unfortunately, after those waves disabled Eighteen, the army abducted her. As to why she was abducted, I honestly don't know. Yeah? But what about the clones? And Cell coming back? Hey, is the army... Yes. The army is behind everything. I was researching tech that could suppress a fighter's power, allowing us to plant the spirit of another inside. The technical term is called linking, and it was perfected not days ago. Shamefully, when I learned the army planned to use it for total cosmic domination, I became afraid and deserted. While on the run, I met Android 18. We decided to flee together. Then we... we ran into Cell. 18 sacrificed herself to save me. So I guess what you're trying to say... is that the Red Ribbon Army is up to their dirty old ways again. And when you tried to quit, they turned on you and tried to hunt you down. Does that sound about right? Yes. Please, you must stop the army. Damn straight we will. Why, we'll tear them to... to... to ribbons! So... You know where their base is, right? We would be very grateful if you showed us the way. I'm sorry, but I wouldn't be able to retrace my steps. I was so caught up in getting away. Ah, uh, great. Oh, by the way, we're gonna go see my friend Bulma. Wanna tag along? You see? The plan is, we're gonna have her take a look at 18. All things considered, you'd probably be much safer with us. Actually, I really should be heading home. I'm worried about my family. Don't worry about me. Finding the base, that must be your top priority. Yeah, whatever you say. <laughs>